Uh, now we saw Mike Watson uh, do quite the number on Gutex yesterday. And Mike Watson, I think, has just been playing great this whole tournament. Now he's up against some really killer competition here. That obviously is Justin Wong. He's continuing to use and abuse this Rufus. And uh, let's see, uh, you know, uh, what to expect in this one. I just expect Justin to be looking for those opportunities to get in there, hopping over a Tiger, getting in and doing exactly just that. Keeping him in the corner and uh, just trying to put on as much pressure as, uh, as possible. That's exactly what Justin's doing as he's just uh, basically being like a carnival clown there, juggling him wow. in the corner. Point to Justin, keeping the him dizzy. In the corner. And uh, first mean, round will go to Justin Wong. Rufus is kind of like Viper, where they can do a lot of damage real quick and get you to a dizzy really early. Even though I think Sagat, uh, like the other Shotos, uh, have an advantage over Rufus in this matchup because uh, all of Rufus, most of Rufus' attacks come from above. Right, right. Um, but uh, trying to use the distance, zoning out just a little bit, that's something he did very, very, very well versus Gutek. But Balrog doesn't exactly have the same uh, skill set to be able to like fly across the screen safely and get in in Sagat's face like what happened yesterday. I mean, Mike Watson just kept him at bay. And again, right now, he's just getting cornered. In and corner, uh, into a dizzy. He just almost makes it look too easy. There's nothing really Mike can do. So, Justin Wong already up a set. That took about like a minute or so. Dude, I, I got to tell you. Even though Justin was one of the guys who came up here and said, hey, look, East Coast is going to wreck. West Coast doesn't have a chance. Justin, so far, is the only guy who's been able to back it up. You know, like, I mean, I mean yeah, he's, he's just so like going fucking through the bracket. consistent, Easy. dude. He's just like, I just don't see the guy really have bad games, really. Um, I mean, play to win right there. But Mike Watson, of course, as any seasoned pro can do, is uh, trying to make some adjustments to make this happen. He got Rufus and Justin Wong down to about 30%. He uh, completely whiffs oh. that uh, EX uh, Tiger uppercut, and he is going to pay dearly for it as uh, he is ultra in the corner. And uh, Justin Wong going to keep oh, wow. that up. Dive the kick into a three round hit. And stuck in the corner. Looking good for Justin Wong to move on to the semifinals. So only one round away now from moving on to the semifinals. And yeah, Justin has been just going through the brackets. I don't think he's lost a round yet. No, I, 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 I don't. I mean, maybe so I'm sure in casuals, uh, I'm sure it's it, it has happened. Uh, but, uh, you know, one thing it, it can say, I, I've seen a lot of Justin Wong fans just like, do not let uh, that BS zoning from Sagat, like, you know, beat you. And uh, he, he, you know, he's he works it. He waits for that patient. He waits for that opportunity, moment uh, of opportunity to actually get in there and uh, get the you know the job done and again he's just doing it he's just switched sides now oh man it's he hasn't made it's gonna be the fourth straight round of being in the corner knocking him down at kimball we oh wow. he ultras him to finish it he didn't even throw him or hit him he he made sure to get the ultra off to win the win the set that was ridiculous uh, that was pretty ridiculous i mean like i said